Guys and welcome to the daily predictions. As I mentioned in the uh, 7 p.m. Uh, video, uh, that I will be making the daily prediction a little earlier for 12th uh, because I will be busy uh, tomorrow, so will not get time to make the prediction for 12th. And I did take the permission from the cards and got the permission to uh, make the video for 12th, and that's why I'm making it. And uh, just a small uh, reminder to you guys: if you can, please uh, share these videos with uh, other people and leave the feedback or press the like button. That makes the video searchable. Okay. So the first card that I have is again energy of 10 this is the wheel which is the wheel of fortune uh, which which energy says that if you see this wheel is not complete yet there is a small little uh, tiny bit that is left for this circle to be completed and uh, this card is giving and you see there is a wheel here in her hands now wheel shows uh, the movement it shows moving forward but also because the way this is and the way she, she is inside this circle I would say first thing is your safety it is very important to keep yourself into the safety circle so in sure that uh, in the morning when you wake up you make a safety circle for yourself or while sleeping at night you make a safety circle for yourself um, second there is a cave here cave is again the sign of safety the sign of security so if possible be at your home or be in a secure or safe place um, there is a vast sea here and this is uh, in the open definitely some kind of circle some kind of work is being completed some kind of circle is being completed and very close to completion of something so just believe in yourself but at the same time, work by keeping yourself safe and you are about to complete that circle. So have faith in yourself, whether it is like a relationship, whether it is like career, whether it is like a goal, whether it is anything, you will be able to complete that. You're very, very close to completion. The second card that I have is uh, uh, three of wands. And if you see, this person had actually planted these uh, wands, uh, these seeds, and now they have uh, become wands. And if you can see, there are uh, leaves that are growing on them. So it is like seeing the result of something that you've done. Uh, Seeing the result of your hard work yes they are not the big tree as of now but they are uh, they have started to bloom and blossom and uh, if you see this person is looking at uh, the road uh, which is actually going to the um, uh, to, to, to these uh, mountains or woods uh, but this person is actually looking at the road and he's waiting for something or waiting for someone to come so this is like when you start seeing the results of your hard work and when you're still waiting for the complete thing to happen or for or for the things to complete or for the work to complete that's the energy so maybe you will start seeing some initial results of your hard work you will start seeing some initial results of uh, things being completed uh, anything that you put your hard work on anything that you put your effort upon um, this could also represent uh, some kind of travel or move uh, but uh, yes something is uh, some material material um, gain or some material evidence or some material uh, um, thing uh, thing of uh, you know things are working out for you will will come your way you will you're going to see something the next card that i have uh, nine of wands uh, i have a little mixed feeling for this card and why i will tell you why because when i see this uh, trouser that this person is wearing uh, you see there is chess board kind of a design that this trouser has and discovered by the dress above this person is wounded and this person is actually waiting with one wand in his hand and uh, these wands are actually protecting him also and these you, he can use to kind of attack on somebody else also now i always get a mixed energy with this card which which to, which tells me one protect yourself which is like the protection energy but at the same time it also tells me that um, somebody who had uh, been uh, planting and plotting somebody who's been playing that game of chess that person is almost caught and trying to safeguard himself but already wounded so um, if somebody has been doing something wrong with you then uh, you're going to see that person very clearly that cycle is going to be completed if somebody has done something wrong to you or some some things were uh, problematic not getting to a result um, you were feeling wounded about something that things are going to get to results so this is one set that i got then the next set that i got is um, uh, first card is um, uh, devil this is the devil energy card uh, Arnan, Arnan no I, I don't know i i can't i couldn't uh, pronounce that anyways so this is a devil card but this is a very very different devil card if you see in this card these are not these two are not chained right they are not changed they are probably the king and the queen of the jungle they are not chained you don't see any chains on them you just see a devil looking at them so this is an energy of devil card but not really that devil is doing some harm to them or devil has done some harm to them it is just um, an energy where devil is looking uh, looking over them now uh, somewhere i again say safety is very important 
mentioned for uh, 12th of October. So keep yourself safe. Keep your be aware of your surroundings and be aware. Don't uh, put down your guards. If I if I put it that way, don't put down your guards. Be aware of your surroundings. That is going to be very important. Um, the second energy that I see is beautiful. This is Empress, and if you see the lady, uh, there is a, a Todd who is also pregnant, and she's pregnant. Her belly is full almost. There are flowers and gifts in her hands, and uh, she's actually st uh, sitting on an edge. So this card basically says uh, it is a motherhood card. It is a mother card. But yes, care is very, very important. Something that you've been working upon, that that thing or that energy is about to come out. There is this number three. This is number three. So the energy kind of remains the same. Uh, this is uh, number three. And this uh, and, and you'll see that flow of energy flowing into the cards. Okay, this is number three. And the energy kind of remains the same. And this is the energy where the weight is going to get over. Something material is going to come out. But at the same time, the safety is very, very important because she's had she has her foot on the edge so safety is very very important um th third card that i have is the star card which is number 17 which is number eight and um this eight or three is actually eight nine ten eleven number eleven okay um eleven and six is what i this is number 16 um so this card says that uh, this star card is everything uh, is out and clear she's nude nudeness means that you are out you are clear uh, you're there uh, people can see the reality of you everything has come into reality and you're nurturing your inner self and outer self so for you it is about nurturing your inner and outer self. It is about to be in your truth, about to be into your reality. And I also feel that in the ref reference of this, I feel that somebody who was kind of playing the games from behind will be out there in the open. So that's the energy that I'm getting uh, from these cards. Um, uh, this is Drought uh, uh, Tarot, I guess. And uh, the second card that I got is from Dragon Energy. And again, the cards are same. I got three cards. And the first energy is Scars. Scars is when you have undergone uh, many, many wounds. You have undergone a lot of uh, a big journey you've actually um, seen a lot of things you've actually experienced a lot of things and that is the energy of the scar which is under the devil where probably you've se you've seen a journey you have uh, seen a lot of things and a lot of difficulties in your life and this is the time to actually uh, know where they fit in your present and realize your self-worth realize your self-worth that why you underwent underwent those things realize that why those things happen to you and how you have to actually um, believe in yourself love yourself give flowers to yourself grow yourself nurture yourself and be the new you that you can and uh, the next card is rose which is an energy of beautiful beautiful roses and growth that has happened so growth roses are never without thorns so that's why you have scars but at the same time when you believe in yourself you become a rose like this so that's the beautiful energy of 12th of october and uh, i also kind of checked in the while i was doing the hindi video that it is the day of kal ratri mata and kal ratri mata if you know she was an avatar of kali that's why kind of a devil energy is there the energy of scars is there but then there is a beautiful energy also that is there so that energy is kind of depicted in the card as well the next set of cards that i got again i got three cards and it is the from uh, wisdom of oracle this is dragon wisdom um the first card is a wind uh, a change in the wind and that cards fits here a change in the wind number 12 and 12th brings in the change in the wind you will be able to see the clear change in the wind that is blowing which means you will be able to see the clear changes in terms of devil energies the cycles being complete the scars the energies opening up in your life you will see the changes where um, you will see you will really realize the negativity in your life you will also realize the negativity that is around you things that you've done but you will also realize your self-worth and you will be you will realize how blessed you are and when you get into your blessings that is when the circle that has always been there like the round and round and um, this is a 12 and this is uh, 7 plus 4 11 so the circle that you've been into uh, the rounds that was never getting over that circle is going to get over so uh, that that circle that was always going round and round you're not able to figure out why things are like this why the things are not changing when you see that change in the wind, wind and you start counting your blessings you are going to see that change in the cycle of life and the circle of life as well so that's beautiful the next card that i have is conscious entity and uh, this is the card where you actually be in your consciousness you consciously see the things you consciously look at the things in a very very beautiful and bright way you realize that there is a peacock here and uh, these feathers belong to the peacock but this energy that is around Sri Krishna that belongs to Krishna so you see that Krishna energy clearly you see that uh, you see the lotus uh, blossoming so you will see the energies very very consciously you will see the impact in the consciousness um, that 12th uh, is going to bring so I, I definitely see a lot of uh, huge impact in the consciousness of yours and the world around you I'm going to take out some extra card like I always 
always do so let's see what is the additional message and in the meanwhile if you uh, want uh, or if you can please uh, press the like button so that uh, people can um, uh, like this video can become searchable and if possible do share this video on your groups or with other people uh, just today or tomorrow um, so let's see what is the additional message and beautiful mm, we have two cards seven of pentacle and the sun card beautiful energy and uh, these cards uh, somewhere show that your your patience are going to pay off so you're going to get reap the fruits of your passion uh, your patience and your patience are going to pay off there is a crown of the king but the king is not there um there is a there is this is this is not really the queen because you cannot see the crown but uh, somebody who has been patiently waiting for king to put his crown down has finally the king has put the crown down and you are seeing the result of the patience so patients are definitely Definitely going to pay you off and second card is sun which is number um, 10 19 is 10 and this is 7 and 10 and this card says uh, there is a new growth there is a new beginning your inner child is healed your inner energy is healed the whole world is kind of uh, blossoming or the whole world is kind of bright everybody can understand and see that brightness some sunflowers are looking at the sun but others are not looking at the sun so you have your own light there will be people who will look for other sources for uh, enlightenment or light or um, guidance but you will be your own guide and you have that energy you will be a conscious ent entity where the uh, uh, patients are going to pay off but again i'm saying that take care of your safety take care of your security uh, put the safety circle going to be very important thank you take care of yourself i hope this resonates with you and if it does please press the like button and share the video thank you take care of yourself bye bye